What is up, Salaman Squad? What I have before you today might be the most beautiful thing you've ever seen in your lives. Now, this is a booster box worth of Elite Trainer, Elite Trainer, a booster box worth of Champion's Path packs. That's right, a booster box, not an Elite Trainer box, not pin collections. This is a loose 36 packs. I'm even going to count it just to be sure. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Should be three things of 12. It is exactly 36 packs of Champion's Path. And we will be opening all of it <clears throat> up today in search of the Rainbow Rare Charizard, the Shiny Charizard, or any of the other Rainbow Rares, as well as Full Arts and others. Now, I was skeptical at first to buy um, individual packs because obviously they can be weighed, but I did see a video on YouTube of somebody weighing these packs, trying to determine the weights, and funny enough, um, actually some of the lighter packs had some of the better pulls. So there's really no justification for weighing. Like there's really no full way to say, oh, this is, this is or is not a card, a good pack because of how much it weighs. Now I did buy these packs all loose, but from one distributor. So I'm hoping, and there we go. Wow. A hop card doubling up on hop, but a beautiful full art card. Um, these are all loose, they're not from the same, I mean, I'm sure they're from similar pin collections or elite trainer boxes and then packaged together, but um, there's really no like set number of things we can pull. We can really get anything here, and uh, there's really no way to um, weigh the packs, so we're just really hoping that we can get something good here. So I'm a chop, slizzlepeed, pokeball, weedle, Kakuna, Beedrill, and a Wailord V card, which was the first card that we have ever pulled from the set that was any good. Now, uh, I've seen a handful of people pull the card that I'm going for. I, myself, do not know anybody that has pulled the card. So, here we go. Great Ball, Weedle, Purloin, Pokeball, Inkay, Galarian Zigzagoon, a Leaf Energy, and a Heat, uh, Heat Ran, a Hat Me. And we're going to have a absolutely amazing recap at the end of this because, I mean, not only <clears throat> are we guaranteed at least 36 holographics, we're guaranteed at least 36 pulls. And I like to count, um, as you know, like the <clears throat> reverse holographic cards of the energies as good pulls too because those can actually become quite a bit of money, but a Kakuna and an Eldegoss V card, which I think I haven't pulled. My buddy pulled two of them in one Elite Trainer box and the Suspicious Food Tin. I did not pull that card until today. Now this pack is giving me some trouble. <clears throat> now the weirdest thing about this was that I'm not, I don't have any code cards for a box or for uh, a pin collection or anything like that, or promo cards. This is all just loose packs, which you never see in another Leaf Energy and a Professor's Research. You never see that in these um, openings, because I mean, these are always like somebody gets the uh, potential uh, code card. Uh, there is damage to this card, so this is the first set that the first pack that I'm praying that we don't get anything good. Like, if this is the pack that we get one of the Charizards on, yeah, it'd be great, but, okay, an Altaria Holographic, but as you can see, there was just waiting on the edge, so that was something that I definitely didn't want to be <clears throat> the, uh, the big money pull. Now, I will be happy with really any cards we pull. I don't want another Suspicious Food Tin, although, of course, that card will be worth something later on as the set gets more and more exclusive and uh, similar to Hidden Fates out of print, but... Nice water energy and a Marnie, but I really want to pull a different Seeker Rare. Um, I already have two of those, so it would be lovely to pull something else. 
Also, the fact that I haven't even sniffed a Rainbow Rare Trainer yet is uh, a little bit telling because those must also be pretty rare to pull if I haven't gotten any of those full heal and a Senna Scorch holographic. It's been a while since I pulled the Senna Scorch holographic as well. So, we are just going down the line here, hoping we get some goodies. Oh, I don't know if I fully showed that, sorry. <clears throat> Fire energy, could this be an omen? Whenever I say that, we end up getting absolutely nothing. Swallow Blue Kakuna, Hattie. Oh my god, are you kidding me? Oh! Are you serious? I'm sorry. Holy. I can't believe we just pulled that. I'm, oh my god. Holy hell, I am shaking. Holy crap. On the one where I asked if it was an omen. Holy crap. Okay, I'm just gonna put, put this down real quick and quickly send a message to my friends that I pulled it. Holy crap. Holy crap. Oh my god. And I pulled it in less packs than it would have taken, than it took me to pull the Charizard VMAX regular card. I need I need to get the sleeves. I'll be right back. Oh my god. Holy shit. I can't believe I just pulled that. Oh my god. I am violently shaking. Holy cow. And we could still potentially pull another one. Oh my god. Well, I was also gonna ask what you thought was gonna be the better pull. Like, what, what half or what third of the box you thought had better pulls. But I mean, unless we pull another Charizard, that, that's the best pull we're getting today. I, I mean, if I pulled the shiny one, I could just sell the rest of these packs, but I'm, of course I'm going to open up, but holy crap, I cannot believe we actually pulled it on one where I asked if it was an omen too, because the fire energy, and whenever I do that, I usually don't get anything. I can't believe that. I'm, I'm still shaking. Like, this is insane. Oh my god, that card is like... 600 to a thousand dollars depending on condition and I mean the condition looks pretty good I mean like the centering looks maybe a little skewed to the left oh man no that's like this is like it lay a little bit to the left but like that's overall that's a pretty good looking card like holy cow like I don't even know what to say oh my god and we still have 26 packs that was in the first or yeah, 24 packs or something. That was in, like, the first... Or I don't even know what I'm saying. 12, 12 packs, so there'd be 24, 26. That was in the first 10 packs we pulled that. Are you kidding me? Oh, my God. It's like, I mean, money-wise, that's the better one to pull, but I did really want to pull a champ holographic. But I did really want to pull the, um... <clears throat> shiny Charizard. That was, like, my favorite of the two, but... My Lord. I... Oh, my God. Oh my god, sorry, I'm just like in the middle of texting because like, oh god. Shaking. Absolutely shaking. But I mean, uh, we're just gonna open it like that, Machamp. Okay, okay, sorry. We're just gonna... That was the first third of the box. There's still a third, there are two thirds to go, so we're gonna take this stack. Um, I'm not trying to sound ungrateful that we got this one. This is the better card to pull and the more rare one to pull. Uh, of my, of the two, my favorite one was that shiny Charizard. 
So fingers crossed that we could potentially even finish the set and get the other one, but holy crap, right now that is just absolutely insane that we pulled that. Oh, I got my boys on Messenger saying hype and everything, and Marnie Holographics, a shout out to Ryan, who just said hype because he watches the videos, and I love him. Shout out to Eric as well, who's also, I got him kind of hooked on these packs, so hopefully he gets something good. He pulled the Suspicious Food Tin, so we're three, we have three Suspicious Food Tins under our belt, um, so that, that's just absolutely nuts. Whew. Water Energy, Victini, Kuba, Team Yell Grunt, Volpix, Rocker Up, Purloin, Nicket, Obst Oh! And an Alcremie VMAX! Oh my god! So we're just, oh, we are just keeping the pulls going. This was such a good idea. Like, this is cheaper, significantly cheaper than buying two of these trainer boxes. Um, or, I got all these packs for about the cost of uh, two and a half elite trainer boxes, like 240 bucks. Um, and I got, you get significantly more packs. So like, this is absolutely insane. I'm like still shaking. Holy crap. Milo, Marnie. Oh. So we still have some of the rainbow rares to pull. Only the, the full art trainer rainbow rares to pull because we've pulled the hop in this opening and in previous ones. Oh, fire energy. No way. No, do not say it's going to be another omen. I'm going to say, is it going to be another omen? Ooh, and maybe we'll pull another one. Kakuna. Oh, I thought I saw the shine, but a Dredna V. I really. I saw the shine, and I thought it was about to be that Charizard again. Or not that Charizard, but the, the shiny one. Holy cow. Oh my god. You guys don't understand how insane that is. Like, I'm having some really good luck in these past couple openings. Like, just, I pulled the, the VMAX Charizard off screen, which stunk, but I got this one on screen. Um, I'm gonna, oh, Fighting Energy and Ascent of Scorch. I'm just gonna upload this video before I upload all of my other Champions Path videos, so like I am so sorry guys because I just want to get this one out, but um, I will have other Champions Path videos that will be showcased like later, that is um, me pulling aka not the Charizard, so you're going to know off the bat that I didn't pull the Charizard, but there's still some really great cards that I pull in those, so definitely, definitely give those a watch, I I've been like behind on videos, but Absol, and ooh, a Corsola V card, I've been behind on videos, um, but damn, um, I've got like crap all over my desk now because there's so many cards. We still got like another half of booster box to go, so this is absolutely nuts. Um, I don't know what other VMAX cards there are actually, unless there's a Cronthon VMAX. I think we have all the VMAXs. Now we have all the VMAX Rainbow Rares. Oh my god, and there's another Dredna VMAX. I have the, uh, I already have this one, but holy crap. The pulls keep coming. This is absolutely insane. We might pull all three Rainbow Rare VMAX cards in the same opening. Gardevoir is the only one left, uh, which I do have a Gardevoir, by the way, but... Woo! I'd like to pull a Rainbow Rare, uh, the trainer card at this point. Like, let's go. I haven't even sniffed one of those yet. Ooh. Uh, but him in regular rare VMAX, ooh, a fairy energy and a Zygarde Hall. We don't have the fairy energy of that, but him in a regular rare VMAX, not the uh, rainbow rare, is the, I think, last VMAX card that I do not have. Um, yeah. Sharpedo, Hatney, Rockeruff, Potion, Pokeball, Carvana, Turf Stadium, ooh, and a Venusaur V card. Absolutely beautiful V-card. I wish there was a Blastoise V-card or a Blastoise V-Max because there's there's the Charizard and there's the Venusaur. The Blastoise ain't getting no love. Whew. Darkness Energy, Team Yell Grunt, Hop, Pattern, Pokeball. I like, don't even need to open anymore. I mean, there's still definitely cards that I need to go for. This is actually one of them that I don't have. A Duralond V-Card, so... Whew. Pull after pull after pull. We got 14 packs left, boys. Oh, well, I should say ladies and gentlemen. Oh my god. This is the best opening in the history of my channel. And solely, not even, like, solely because of the Charizard, but, like, we've gotten some 
fire pulls. Like, this is definitely by far my best champ. And there's an Incineroar V card. This is definitely my... That's three V cards in a row. Um, this has definitely been my best champion's path opening to date. And probably, like, even without the Charizard, it would have been my best champion's path opening to date. Um, I got duds in some of my first boxes. But holy cow. Let's go. Machoke, Purloin, Ekans, Potion, Vulpix, Inkay, Hyper Potion, and a Corsola V again. So we are... Two thirds of the way done with this box. That's right. We've only completed two thirds of the box, and we have all these pulls. This has been a master, master class video, and I am so happy I sprung on this. Um, I think anybody who's thinking about buying should buy loose packs like this. Like this was way better. Than, like I know boot, the lead trainer boxes are great because yeah, you get the the promo card, but I've got five of those. So at this point, I was like, excuse me. At this point, I was like, I don't want any more promo cards. I want the real deal. And a Corsola V again. We are just banging these packs out. That's that's five V cards in a row. My first two Elite Trainer boxes, my first 20 packs, I got two V cards. Like, these packs have been banger after banger after banger of packs. The only way this video could get any better is if we pulled that Charizard, the other one. Holy coly Trubbish, Rotom Phone. Oh my god! No! 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 I don't believe it! I don't believe it! I don't! I don't believe it! Are you kidding me? No! No, this is insane. Another Rainbow Rare VMAX Charizard. What the hell? This is the best video I've ever done in my career. Probably will ever do. I... D oh my god, you're kidding me. You are kidding me. That is... Unreal. That we've just pulled a second one. And I was sitting here saying, Oh, this is gonna be the best part of the booster box. Like, was the first half. No. Oh, we're, we keep plugging. There's still that that rainbow, or not that rainbow, the shiny Zard. But we've gotten six packs of really good pulls in a row. You're kidding me. This is insane. Oh my god. I can't believe. Did we get a fire energy on that one as well? Machamp, finally a holographic. But did we get also get a fire energy? Like, that is not possible. That is so insane. I cannot believe that that just happened, that we've gotten two Rainbow Rare Zards. Oh my god, could we pull the shiny Zard? Could we make it the three-peat? Like, that would be insane, Galarian, obtuse, gone, blah blah blah, Altaria, like, I don't care. Why have I pulled two Rainbow Rares VMAXs and <laughs> one of the regular VMAXs? Like, this doesn't make sense, make it make sense, Pokemon Company. Holy cow, I'm giving this guy a fat thumbs up for selling me this on eBay. Purloin, Nickit, Slizzlipede, like I really didn't think this would be possible to pull even one, but like, let alone one, but we pulled two. Holy crap. Still don't have the shiny. Inke, Pokeball, Sizzlepeed, Galarian, Zigzagoon, Zygarde, now, <clears throat> now we're getting all the, all the hollow cards to wrap this up, but that's good, because, like, my blood pressure could not handle another VMAX card or a shiny one, like, I'd love it, but I don't, I don't think, I wouldn't survive another one, Hatney, Rockruff, Potion, Pokeball, like, it's just the same level of excitement we got four packs off the same level of excitement that when you pull that first one like i i had more no i didn't have more of the second one i wasn't shaking as bad but like i definitely had more of the first one but i'm sitting here just dumbfounded this was absolutely insane i am so happy i got to open this this booster. a fire energy could it be another omen <laughs> there's no way we we triple up like that would just not be possible i do have good luck but not not that good of luck malmar and a dreadna v
I need to buy an elite trainer box now just to like save at this point because I definitely want uh, I want one to just to hold on to um, because like the price is just gonna get mad and insane like later on down the road like the hidden fates one is 370 almost 400 bucks so this is weedle peers oh I don't have this card yes the Corsola V card this is actually one of my favorite just just cards in the set not like comparatively with the Charizards or anything, but just because it is so pretty. So, and I definitely want you guys to vote which third of the box is best because honestly, like yeah, the ch the two the two ones with the Charizards would probably obviously be front runners, but like the middle one had a V Max, like a, a Rainbow Rare V Max, a V Max, and like five other. V card, so like it was definitely up there for a good, good like pack. Like it definitely wasn't like a bad twelve packs by any chance. Um, so it's really up to you guys on what you think was the was the better third of the box. Um, I mean those two Charizards really make it hard to compete as as for the as like the middle. Um, and unless we pull another Rainbow Rare or something in this pack, it's gonna be really hard. To, to decipher between the two um but yeah so th i just wanted to say an early thank you guys so much for watching um but i'll say it again but a pokeball lichen rock any professor's research to end the box this was a banger of a box an absolutely insane box so i'm going to do some real quick sorting before i do my little end card and we get to see all of the amazing pulls that I got but um yeah no just all in all thank you guys so much for watching my content um, this is just like I'm still shaking this is absolutely insane oh my god just the level of cards we didn't pull a rainbow a rainbow uh, full art card which those seem to be very elusive but I'm not complaining when we pull these cards like you would, I would have to be an idiot to be like, oh, I'm sad because I didn't get my rainbow trainer card. Because, like, I would take these over, <laughs> over that any day of the week. This was the best 230 bucks I've ever spent on Pokemon in my life. Like, that is nuts. Nuts. And I'm sure you guys know just how nuts it is. Like, you guys aren't stupid. But... Holy cow. Three Rainbow Rare cards? Are you kidding me? And two of them being the monies? Look at this fat chunk of cards, but a Zygarde, Senescorch, Marnie, Marnie, Lycanroc, Zygarde, blah blah blah. All these holographics that we all have a million of. And now into the energy cards. We got a good variety today and some new ones. Fairy and Fighting Energy are definitely new. A Wailord V card. Eldegross V-Card, Galarian Corsella V-Card, Corsella V-Card, Dredna, three Corsella V-Cards, Incineroar V-Card, Doralundo V, Venusaur V, Full Art Hop Trainer, Full Art Dredna V, Full Art Galarian Corsola V, beautiful card, uh, V-Max, Al Alcremi V-Max, Dredna Rainbow Rare uh, V-Max, Charizard Rainbow Rare V-Max, Charizard Rainbow Rare VMAX. So thank you guys very much for watching. Let me know what you have pulled out of this set and what cards you've gotten online and, and everything. But thank you guys so much, and I'll see you in the next video.